All right, what's up, Facebook group exploders? So I'm back. I'm gonna be going over the uh, first video that I kind of just talked about in our last video, uh, which is what have I actually done over the last seven days to get this group to grow from you know zero to a hundred people in seven days, right? So uh, basically, I've, I've kind of already hinted on this before, and I've been telling you guys in other videos if you haven't watched them yet. Um, you know, the first thing that you gotta do is you gotta go out there and kind of establish establish yourself as you know kind of like the expert right so uh basically all you're gonna do is once you've created your group which hopefully you've already got a group at this point if not i can definitely do a video on that later um but basically you should have a very niche specific group it looks like a lot of the people in this uh, group itself are actually people that are doing like affiliate marketing and stuff like that which is uh totally cool because there's a huge market for affiliate marketers um to grow their groups and stuff but basically, you know, once you got your niche, you, you start your group, and then it's like, okay, well, how do I get people to come into my group? So first thing you do is, if it's for affiliate marketing, obviously you're gonna go out and join a whole bunch of different affiliate marketing groups, like I said before. Go in there and start just commenting and posting, uh, answering as many questions as you can, like as much stuff as you can, and this does a, a few different things for you. First of all, uh, when you're answering questions, it's gonna start putting yourself in, like a, uh, in that expert position, right? But the other cool thing is, is when you're commenting and answering questions and liking and posting and all the different things that go into Facebook, uh, just period, um, you know, the admin of that group or the, the owner of the group, or the leader of the group or whatever you want to call it, you know, they're going to start recognizing you. Just like, you know, there's members of this group that I already, you know, I recognize because of the fact that they're liking all the different comments and they're posting uh, comments and they're also, you know, doing their their hashtag live videos and all that good stuff um, what happens is you start kind of building a relationship without you even knowing it you're gonna start building a relationship with the admin of that group right so that's uh, first and foremost get into all these other groups and start uh, getting to know um, you know no members that are inside that group and then obviously you can start um, going into some groups there's there's groups like for affiliate marketing uh, for instance there's like affiliate marketing worldwide or something like that and it's like a group of you know whatever a hundred and some thousand members or whatever and it's basically just a spam group right like you, you're not gonna get a lot of results out of like those kind of spam groups but you will get some kind of results and very simply uh, you can go in there and just post like hey guys I started this group it's about this uh, go check it out you know if you want to learn more you know join the group kind of thing and those kind of posts like I said you can definitely get some engagement and get people to join your group that's basically what I've been doing so far um, or if you see people that are that are promoting like you know um, these put your business link below or, or whatever your opportunity comment below or whatever um, those posts I actually get a better reaction out of uh, than just kind of posting it inside of a main group itself because of the fact that you know people are, are kind of it, it's constantly scrolling it's kind of weird how it works but anyway when you post on there you can say hey I don't have a, an actual business opportunity for you but I do know this blah 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 I share it inside my group make sure to join my group and then put the link right now both of those tactics guys it's gonna be a lot of work like you go out and post a whole bunch you know um, like I said you, you want to try to do it in at least 10 groups and out of that 10 you might get 10 new members right it's not gonna be something that really super uh, grows your group but that's basically all I've been doing up until this point like I said uh, going inside a different group saying hey you know I started a group literally last week I'm uh, gonna be teaching how you know how to grow your group on Facebook uh, you know if you're interested you know check it out and, and that's basically it. I've done that you know like I said maybe a dozen times over the last week so um, that got quite a few people in right and then recently uh, I well yesterday I did a contest like the first contest now you know maybe you like contests or maybe you don't but a contest does a lot of a lot of good for you and uh, I was gonna do like another video just kind of talking about you know the contest and my thoughts on it but I think I'll just add it to this one because this video is not really that long not as long as I thought it was gonna be um, so basically guys when you do a a promotional uh, contest or something like that like right now I got the uh, contest going whoever invites the most members in a 24-hour period is gonna win either $50 from me or a half-hour coaching call from me right like we're all get on the phone with you and we'll call and I'll answer whatever questions you got and talk whatever you want to talk about uh, for a half hour right um, and all you got to do is invite members like you, they don't even have to join you just got to invite them now when I posted that you know um, 
actually it was one of my buddies from I say buddies a guy that I went to high school with you know was in the group and he's like I don't understand why you do this it seems like you're begging for um, people to join or whatnot but trust me I'm not trying to beg people to join it is very powerful for you as the group leader as well as the actual people that partake in the contest right and the reason being you know if I can give away fifty dollars to one of my members of my group you know first of all it's cool to win money right like and it doesn't have to be money it could be a book or you know anything else you could just grab something off your shelf at home that you think that your uh, you know your members would enjoy having right and the more obviously the more valuable it is the more people you'll probably get to participate but if you throw out a contest kind of like this one where it's not like a huge prize you know like 50 bucks isn't that uh, it's not life-changing money by any means right but the thing is is now I know who in this group are you know first of all you know who's a team player and then also what's up Bo uh, Bogdan um, so I, I know who's a group uh, or a team player uh, but also I get to see like it kind of it builds up that re relationship to where it makes it even better you know um, like I was saying before he uh, my buddy from high school Chad was saying that he doesn't see what the incentive is you know why would you do that so first of all if you're a member of a group and the group admin is asking you to, to participate in some kind of um, you know comment or not comment but some kind of contest or something like that what happens is when he starts seeing the people that are actually participating that automatically builds you a relationship with that admin you know and for me like doing this contest now I know that Sava and Amit are uh, both people that are you know team players are helping out this group and going forward if they ever reach out to me in a message like I guarantee you I'm gonna get back to them because they're willing to help me out it's the law of um, recip re recip reciprocity I, I can't even pronounce it but basically it's if you scratch my back I'll scratch your back right so when it comes to doing contests and stuff like that that guys if you're in a group where you're you know you're trying to build relationships because that's what groups are all about right building relationships and trying to um, establish yourself kind of like as this leader right so this is how I've landed interviews with some of the, the world's top affiliates like uh, Catlin Betridge Spencer Meacham Liam James K uh, Rachel S. Lee, like I've interviewed and talked to all these people and we are now at a level where if I write them a comment on Facebook, like they answer the comment, they answer my questions, you know, they get back to me and that's exactly what you're trying to do. So when you're inside of other groups, like I said, you want to be commenting and posting as much as possible because that puts you in front of that admin, right? Now as an admin, you're going to start noticing the same thing when you're building your group that all the people that start commenting and posting and all that kind of stuff, um, you know, they'll, you'll start recognizing them, you know, just like Bogdan uh, that joined. So, like, I know him because he's always commenting, he's always posting, he's always liking. So I know him, like, on a first-name basis. If he ever reaches out to me, I'm going to get back to him, right? Just like Sava. Sava just joined. You know, what's up, Sava? So, like, Sava joined one of my other groups, uh, you know, one of the the last group that I grew to 1,000-plus members in 90 days. But he always posts and comments and likes and, you know, does all that stuff that's necessary to get himself kind of in a position where like I know him by name and I guarantee you he will vouch for for me when I say that if Sava sends me a message I reply like we've had phone conversations right and uh, you know to where I'll call him up using Facebook you know the phone on Facebook whatever you call that um, you know and we have conversations and we strategize together and we come up with game plans and he's like we've already mentioned this before in the group but he started off you know kind of shy and bashful and now like He's taking off and he's going places, right? Like he's stepping outside of his comfort zone, doing all the things that I've been teaching you guys, uh, you know, to just to just rock and roll and be the best that you can be as far as you know, growing your brand and stuff online. So, you know, Salva's a perfect example, and he's done this like in a very short amount of time, you know, which is awesome. Like that's what we're all here to that's what we're all here to do, right? Like to grow a group to a thousand plus members in 90 days or less. That is a pretty cool feat you know and uh, it's not easy to do you got to go out there and do the work so like I said the first thing that you guys want to do 
go out there and start answering questions, commenting in all these other groups. Get yourself positioned because at some point, guys, if you're if you're helping out somebody else's group enough, you can reach out to that admin of the group and probably get some kind of shout out, you know, or get them to join your group. Um, and that's ultimately what it's all about, like just networking, right? Growing groups is all about networking. Um, when you know when I posted the contest and, and Chad was saying you know he doesn't see what the incentive is and it, it seems like you're begging for members or or whatever that's because he doesn't understand online marketing he's not an online marketer he's a um, he's actually a hail dent repair guy and he's trying to be a politician so I understand where he's coming from he likes to debate and that's fine but you know most of us in this group are you know are here because we we are online marketers or affiliate marketers. We're trying to grow our brand and grow our groups is one of the best ways to do that. So anyway, kind of rambling on a little bit, but yeah, definitely. So you can see the power of doing a contest. So when I launched the contest, there was only 85 members in the group. There's now like 106 and there's really only two people. Two people out of the 85 are actually inviting members into the group. You know, So you can see how powerful that is. It grows it rather rapidly. Um, you know, yes, you are technically paying somebody to help you grow your group, but that's what it's all about. Like we're going to be sharing our networks, you know, and, and this group of any group is probably one of the best groups to really, you know, help get more members in because of the fact that we're all about promoting everybody else's group. Right. So, um, and with that being said, guys, if you have a group, if you've already started a group and you haven't uh, asked me to join yet, or you haven't posted it inside of this group, make sure that you post your link in the group. There's a, a pinned post that says post your group link you know in the comments below make sure you post it in there I'll join and then I'll actually recommend it so that whenever somebody comes in and they look at like the uh, members area and they can see where the admin recommendations are like your group will be in there you know so just a little added bonus but yeah basically that, that's all I've done so far right to get a hundred members in this group um, and no I didn't like go and post all kinds of crazy posts inside of my other groups just asking them to come I do have several people in this group from my other group but I've only done like one or two posts maybe uh, similar to what I just said you know hey I just started a new group about Facebook groups uh, come and join you know and that's all I did I was I haven't direct messaged anybody or anything like that um, and that's basically it so that's how we went from zero to 100 guys in seven days and, and now it's a fact now it's just a matter of uh, keeping your your members engaged make sure you're coming up with questions um and then reaching out to them like let them know that you are a real person uh i did a post yesterday or the day before talking about how uh, or where in the world are you or you know where do you live in the world or whatever it was you know something something like that like i said i typically try to wait until we get closer to 100 members uh to do that just because then you can start getting some really good engagement uh, everybody wants to share uh, stuff about them so obviously asking them where they're from it works and then the cool thing is is you know people can network so there's a bunch of people from the UK that comment on it they could all like actually go out and um, you know meet people meet each other in real life if they wanted to and start like an offline group right and that would be awesome but basically what that's gonna do like I said before uh, with the goal being trying to get as many much engagement in the group as possible to grow as much as possible um, you know, doing a post like that is great because it's going to get a whole bunch of people to put comments. And then what I would do is I, if I were you as a group leader or the admin of the group, make sure that you go, to, uh, go in there and, you know, if they say they're from wherever, just ask them, hey, cool, man, if I came to visit, what would be like a cool thing to do or what's a cool thing to see? Just again, get them engaged. The more you can keep your, your engagement going, the more questions you can ask them, the more they answer, the more Facebook is gonna see that your group is like a hot group and it's gonna help promote it for you. So that's about it, guys. Um, trying to think of what else. Other little things like that that you can do rather than just like, you know, where are you from? Once you get 100 members or more, you know, you can do questions like, all right, I'm thinking of a number one to 100. The person that you know guesses it gets a free ebook or something like that. Whatever, another little cool contest giveaway kind of thing. Um, and then you'll get you, you know you'll get a whole bunch of posts because obviously people are gonna guess at least one through a hundred. And then once somebody guesses whatever number you actually uh, you actually guess, you can just say yeah, so and so won with number fourteen or whatever it was. So anyway, 
hope that makes sense guys uh i know this one got a little long because i was gonna make it two videos but if you watched all the way through it guys definitely leave a comment below ask me any questions that you got uh and i will definitely get back to you so thank you so much for being a part of this group helping grow this group big shout out to saba for uh inviting so many people and admit you know for inviting so many people um because obviously you know together we'll do it better that's my mo my motto my mantra or whatever you want to call it and uh, i really believe in it because teamwork makes the dream work so thank you guys so much for watching this video we will see you in the next one go out there uh, and apply these little tips and tricks and strategies to your own facebook group and let me know how it goes you know i'm really interested to see uh you know how it's working for you and um you know and how it's going so reach back out to me and i'll see you guys in the next video see ya